The European Commission can play the role of a kind of a honest broker to uh, to also link between the the, uh, the various member states. I mean, when we speak about uh, about uh, about the EU, and in addition to that, we can also uh, contribute with. Uh, uh, resources which are uh, in Horizon 2020, but I think I mean it is important that uh, yeah, I mean our role is to uh, to support the activities to be uh, with other I mean the member states, uh, mm -hmm. African Union and so on, to contribute to support this initiative, but also yeah to um, contribute to this uh, to this uh, steering process. I think it is very important because we have. There have been a lot of investments in many areas and um, I think that what we have to try to do is to be more strategic about what we do. Also because it delivers better, it delivers better, but also because um, we need I mean, to be more efficient with the spending of the taxpayers' money. Well, that they like the idea and that they're also ready to commit some of their uh, resources to uh, contribute to it. Um, I think at the end of the, of the day, I mean, this question of food security, which was back uh, on the agenda of the, of the, um, I mean, the policymakers, uh, the society as a whole, I mean, came in the late 80s, uh, I mean, food security is, uh, is uh, a challenge that um, involves everybody. And I think, I mean, on this, uh, we should be able to attract uh, interest from, uh, from the different member states and also try to, yeah, to have them on board and to have them on board also with the uh, contributions of their own. This partnership will probably be, take time, a bit of time to, uh, to, to get established. <coughs> and I guess as long as trust builds and so on, I think there will be more and more players into it. And mm -hmm. uh, I hope that it will, uh, it will yeah, come up as something which is quite uh, a sizable effort and also a sizable partnership between, between Europe and Africa.